In this video, we'll look at distances on an astronomical scale within the solar system and beyond. Astronomical distances tend to get very big very fast. For this reason, astronomers will usually quote distances in light years. One light year is defined as the distance travelled by light in one year. To put this into context, light from the sun takes eight minutes to reach the Earth. We can say this distance is equal to eight light minutes. Light from the sun takes five and a half hours to reach Pluto at the very edge of the solar system. Let's take a look at some larger distances on an interstellar scale. After the sun, the nearest star to us is Alpha Centauri. The distance between the sun and Alpha Centauri is about four light years. The size of our home galaxy, the Milky Way, is a hundred thousand light years. Hopefully, you are starting to get an idea of the vast scale of the universe. Next, if we zoom out as far as we possibly can go, we find the size of the observable universe is a gigantic 93 billion light years across. If you're taking the extended paper, you'll need to be able to use the conversion between a light year and meters in calculations. If one light year is the distance traveled in the vacuum of space by light in one year, then using the values for the speed of light and the number of seconds in one year, we find the distance traveled by light in this time is equal to speed times time, which is three times 10 to the eight meters per second times 365 days times 24 hours times 60 minutes times 60 seconds. And this gives us one light year as 9.5 times 10 to the 15 meters. Let's see what a question on this might look like. How long does it take light to reach the Earth from a galaxy which is located 15 billion light years away? A light year is the distance light travels in a year. Therefore, the only answer can be D as light will take 15 billion years to travel a distance of 15 billion light years. So, how far away is this galaxy in metres? 15 billion is a 15 with nine zeros after it, or 15 times 10 to the nine light years. Now, all we have to do is multiply the distance in light years with the distance in metres which is 15 times 10 to the 9 times 9.5 times 10 to the 15. This gives us an answer of 1.4 times 10 to the 26, which is option D as well. If you're taking the extended paper, it's recommended you learn this number, but you can use the method above to calculate it if you need to. In summary, astronomers use light years as a unit of distance between interstellar objects. One light year is defined as the distance travelled in the vacuum of space by light in one year. Students taking the extended paper should know the conversion between light years and metres. The familiar equation speed equals distance over time can be used for calculations involving light in the solar system. This uses the fact that the speed of light is a constant everywhere in the universe. Don't forget to check out all of our other fantastic revision resources here at Save My Exams.